the lecture. Whoever has missed, I would like you to participate as well, if you can, and tell me. So <clears throat> the first example that you can see over here is a town contains 5,000 houses. Each house owner must pay tax based on the value of the house. Houses over 200,000 pay 2% 2 of their value in tax. Houses over 100,000 pay 1.5% of their value in tax and houses over 550,000 pay 1% of their value in tax. All others pay no tax. Write an algorithm to solve the problem using pseudocode. Okay, now obviously, um, right now I'll just do it with you. Uh, you. You can think over it, how can we do it? Okay, so obviously uh, what we can do over here is we can, we need to do is we have to find for 5,000 houses. So each house can, so we have to obviously um, somehow we'll have to run a loop over here because we have to find for all 5,000. So we can, we'll use over here is we can use four. We can also do this with count as well. Okay. I, I will try to solve this with count as well with you. So we can say over here, let's say for count, I'm not doing the declaration over here today. We'll do it afterwards. So for count one to 5,000, right? Uh, tab, we need to, let's say, input the house. I'm not doing the de declaration, okay? Um, is someone helping me out? Okay, I'll do it myself. So you, what will we use over here? I mean, just just an idea. Are we if going? Statement. Very good, excellent. We'll use a statement. Let's say, if the house, uh, let's say first of all is greater than oh, let put space, is greater than fifty thousand. Then we can say is let's say the tax will be house into, or we can simply use the star, oh, not this one, it's wrong with my key. Uh, what's the rate for this? It's 0 0.010. Yes or no, 1%. Okay, yeh ho jayega, right? Achha. Otherwise, we will use over here is else if house is greater than 100,000, right? Then obviously the tax would be House multiplied by zero point zero one five, and we keep on doing this. Uh, else, if okay, this this else actually it doesn't have to be capital. Okay, uh, house is greater than we have over here is two hundred thousand. Okay, then. Okay, when I went to sudden use cut here. Then we will do is the tax would be the house multiplied by its uh, point two. So it's point zero two. Right. Jabi Sara Hojaiga obviously uh, Else, obviously, the tax is zero because they mentioned that. They, they pay, pay, pay no tax. And obviously, it's optional, but we can obviously use over here is the print. Uh, print. print what? Print the tax. Right? And we can use the next for this. So this is the way we will do this. Yes, any question, Curie? Is it clear? Please have a look. Any question? Was there a question? 
Uh, Python, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I know, but I'll not include Python right now. I'll not include it right now. Um, but obviously, I'll give you some work in the summer breaks to practice with it. Okay. But obviously, the Python, uh, the reason why we will be doing it because I want you to start with P4. And obviously, this will help us a lot afterwards. Okay, right now, we'll just target P1 and P2. Okay. Or we say, or about the P2 ke advanced questions. Hai na. Uh, honestly speaking, um, if you would have done Python with me, obviously, how many times other milega P2 me? Once we do Python, you'll be able to handle P2 k last questions much more easily. Okay. So print ka P capital or small. Print ka P small of Thank you. Print ka P capital name of Small. Is it else ka ye? E small. And E small. Anything else? Right. Anyone has any question? Please abhi pseudo code abhi target karlo. Um, it's not neat. It's N E X T. Sir? Yes. A question uh, like uh, directly re related to any else, like answer the past papers carries it as the better. The search can a question of file can the type carabo array or usko read carre as a search can the pseudo code map any read read can be used car as a function. Not he can they can also came a banana new was a read new on input cacao on or not. Nika out input ka input the data or something. Sir, input input can never cow as a age usnava sida sida lika read jo bi data. Can you can um can you can you share with me if you go through it? Agar apu the bara mire. Up group share kardia correcies because this would help everyone. Okay. Yes, sir. I don't know if I'm going to do it. I don't know if I'm going to do it. We haven't done file handling. We will do it on Saturday. We can easily do it. Try it. You can see the question. Let's go or break it. If you can't. So, this is what you have. So, write an algorithm using pseudocode which takes temperatures input over a hundred day period once per day. Okay, it's once per day, fine. And output the number of days when the temperature was below 20 degrees Celsius and the number of days when the temperature was 20 degree or above. Achha, so this may obviously, what is an important thing? So this may, um, what is coming in your mind? The basic uh, thing. So decomposition may kya aega aapke, aapke zin mein aura hooga ke I obviously need to do, the question is asking me to total something and, and what do I have to total? I have to take the temperature, input over 100 day period, okay, and uh, output the number of days. So I have need to find out the total number of days the temperature was below 20 and I have to find the total number of days when the, uh, it was 20 degree or above. So below 20 and above 20. So obviously for both of these, I have to use two different totals. So if someone wants to add, let me know. So I could say over here is if the total, um, I could say total one or I could say total less than 20. Okay, uh, I could say less. Uh, yeah, yeah, I can, I can just say total one is basically zero and same way, Total two is also zero. So both totals are zero. Yes or no? Now what the important thing is, write an algorithm used to do good, which will take temperature input over a hundred day period. Once a day. Okay. So hundred day period come nikar na. So hundred day period ke obviously we can use over here uh, let's say for loop. My for series ka so my customer for days uh will be. One two hundred. Okay, so one two hundred. I will input the temperature. Right. Okay, right. Then I would use an if command because I want to see over here is if the temperature is less than twenty. Let me put a space. If it's less than twenty, then 
total one. <coughs> then I'm going to say total one. Ab main isko niche ke bhi likh sakta hoon. Waise ya 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 bhi likh sakta hoon. It's fine. Doesn't make a difference. I can say what is total one plus one. Increase obviously. Else, I'm saying total two. Total two plus one, and simply oh, let me just uh, iske baad hum kya karenge? Uh, what are we left with? We are left with end if, or ham iske baad we'll just uh, for use kiya, so we can just have the next. Or ham last last ne kar denge. Let's say we can print is the total total one comma total two, right? So this is the way this is supposed to be done. Is this clear? So no, not very complicated. You first of all have to see your variables kaun se hai. You have to see those variables are initialized with with value. Then you have to see is are you using any selection over here? Okay, usme range kaun si hai? Or variable use karte wo range define karo. Then us, uske baad obviously you you will you will uh, use an if statement. Okay, uh, to obviously compare if it's this, then do this. Otherwise, do this. So one important part this, the other important part was this. Yes. Any question? Anyone? Okay. Uh, Saturday, when you come, you will give me more pseudocode ki practice. Dunga. Okay. Uh, mein ya end, we need to practice it more. Because, okay. Let's do past paper ke or pseudocode ki practice. But um, first, we need to finish uh, the, the, the content which is left. Then we will do it. Okay. Do I have more examples? Yes, I have another example. Have a look at this. Okay. Now, I will give you 5 minutes. Uh, can you just write a rough draft of this? Okay. Five minutes, all of you. Roughly, isko likho. What do you think so the output will be? Aisha, sorry, beta, you uh, you left. You joined back. Sir, so, beta, I'm recording. Karo, I'll share with you. I'm recording. Click on. अच्छा ये इसका सुडो कोड लिखना है हमने आ, मैं मैं 5 मिनट दे रहा हूं थिंक ओवर इट क्या सुडो कोड होगा रफली लिख लो फिर मैं डिस्कस करता हूं दिस इज लाइक एट मार्क क्वेश्चन Okay, sorry, I'm going to pause. Okay. So what's going on over here? What was it? discuss case again. Anyway, so I've defined a function substring. Okay, my string is of data type string. Start is of data type integer. Length is of data type integer. Okay, return string. If the length of my string is greater than equal to the length plus start, is ka kya matlab hai? Hmm, yes. For example, a function to find a substring. To find a substring of a given length starting at a given place in a string that returns a null string rather than error. So basically, you will see if my string, uh, if if agar iski, uh, if it's greater than iski length, if it's greater than the length 
प्लस स्टार्ट ओके तो क्या हो देन रिटर्न मेड माई स्ट्रिंग स्टार्ट से लेंथ तक तो मतलब एर ना दे इट स्टार्ट फ्रॉम द बिगिनिंग गोज टिल दी एंड ओके एल्स रिटर्न जीरो एल्स रिटर्न नथिंग ओके यू वन गेट दिस वे मुझे ख्याल से भी पाइथन में करेंगे तो आपको समझ आएगी एनी वे मकसद मेरा बताने का था कि हाउ डू वी डिक्लेयर अ सब स्ट्रिंग सो इट्स नॉट वेलिवेंट एग्जाम्पल हाउ डू डिक्लेयर अ फंक्शन सेल्सियस टेम्परेचर बताओ उसका रियल रिटर्न रियल सो रिटर्न टेम्परेचर ठीक है uh that's how we define in in uh, python def celsius i think so we have discussed and we put the parameter temperature inside it so that's how we declare functions function celsius aur uske andar hum uske parameter define karte hain magar pseudo code mein we need to have the data type inside it so temperature ki data type then it turns real that's how we do with functions and functions obviously have to be called ठीक है अच्छा फंक्शन की हम प्रैक्टिस भी हम करेंगे और क्योंकि ऑब्वियसली लास्ट फंक्शन और फाइल्स इज द लास्ट टॉपिक जो हमारा डिस्कशन रह गया ओके ये तो हम कर चुके हैं सॉफ्टवेयर डेवलपमेंट राइट बेटा